win, goals, good home debut, quite a bit to talk about, uh, welcome to Tight TV now I see yeah, so back to winning ways, again, pleasing to see uh, things have been worked on, you could tell that on pitch, excuse my voice, <clears throat> shouting and that, uh, so yeah, where do we go, I mean right from start, uh, high tempo, high press, it was intense, we took the game to them, three goals in what, 20 minutes, it was something like 17 minutes, something like that, we're three and out up, could it have been more, possibly so, but again, I thought we were well in control, different goals from different areas of pitch, from different build-ups, again, Bobby Thomas, we'll get on about him in a minute, but Norwood, again, I think one of the best games I've seen him play as a bouncer player. I don't mean that disrespectful about, you know, scoring a goal against um, Sheffield Wednesday away and all that kind of stuff, but it's all around performance, holding ball up, being in and amongst it, knowing what he can do, um, what he can do, regards what he gets to get up and amongst it in games like this. And for me, it was pleasing to see that it were a different front two. It was something different. Some some what changed. Had it been worked on him, you know, midweek. Who knows? But again, for me, it's good to see that certain players are coming in and showing what they can do, what we know they can do. Bobby Thomas. Shout out to him. Um Home debut, I thought he had a great home debut with me, I thought he looked solid, he looked vocal, he looked in command, a tall, tall lad. I was particularly watching to him in second half, how vocally well we Anderson and Kitchen, organised, structured, wanted to come out as a unit, as offsides. For me, I, I, I like the player, I know it's the only game I've seen him play at all, well, his first game. But what I've seen via, I'm hoping that club can somehow make this one a permanent deal. I just like his presence. There's something about him. There's something about him. Uh, you just get that feeling. And he might be getting too far in front of him, but he looked accomplished and assured. So I thought it slotted in pretty well via. Aitchison, Williams, both getting goals. Again, Good for Aitchison for his confidence and has been out with some issues and that and he's come back and it was something different. So all of it pitch for me, I thought it would be Kane. I thought he had a decent game as well. Luke Connell being Luke Connell. And I don't think we're really threatened as such. I don't think we're really threatened as such. So for me, a good all-round performance, goals that we're calling out for. Just the end, it were disappointing to see that we conceded a goal. It would be nice to have a clean sheet, but when I when I looked at that goal and I've rewatched it back, you know, again it was more or less straight. I was straight in front of it, kind of thing at one end where it was. And for me, it wasn't a penalty. It was not a penalty. It, it, it but I should have cleared it, but it's only bounced down. Just put it in Rose head. But it fumbled, and as we were coming away, you could see him getting bundled over. You know, he was in front of a ball, and the Ackerton player come from behind him and made it an awkward, awkward challenge. For me, it wasn't a penalty and disbelief, so I didn't think it was a penalty. Yeah, it was last kick game, and like someone said behind us, what. You know what if that what if that had been a if we were only bought one note up it was one of them kind of contentious decisions, but we we'll get get off that because you don't want to make it about ref and stuff, but more about praise for her uh, side. Uh, credit to Duff, he changed it uh, from to top. top. Uh, Max Watters came on, but for me. My man at match, I'm going to have to get Norwood. 
I know Edson got it on day, but for me, my man at match went forward, just for work effort and work rate to put in, you know, making some busy, really fetching others into it, fetching others into play, holding the ball up well. All around performance for me, you know, would. Uh, my man at match, I'd be interested to in know your thoughts. Please leave them below in comments. We are man at match war. But again, I thought for certain areas at pitch, I thought Thomas at back, what stand out for me for uh, defensive uh, unit of the three. I thought in midfield, I thought every case slightly edged it over. I had Adam Phillips. I mean, Adam Phillips had a decent game as well, but link up play. Then you could say Luke Connell, so it's a bit of a conundrum in midfield. Oh, what actual stand out there? I might just go with. It's an hard on this. Might just go with Kane. But it's an hard one. And up front, Norwood obviously fought goal, but a good all round performance, a lot of positive to cart in it. Not to get carried away, you know, tough, uh, a tough trip away at Exeter now. Not to get carried away, but we're still in. Fate. We're still up there on state. Please see we've got some goals in, you know, in his bank account. Need this for to goal difference for what we've happened previous. But yeah, we move onwards and upwards. Extra game coming up, so and then now it's at weekend. So it'd be interesting to know what uh, your thoughts will that will be going into the game. As always, please like, subscribe, and share. Let me know your co uh, thoughts and comments in. Uh, below, I do re reply to all of them. Have a good rest of your weekend. One thing left to say, you Reds. <laughs>